Hey, Steve here. I'm in the middle of doing something. You want to come along for the ride? I'm going to turn this treadmill into a belt sander. I did some nonsense one day with that one there gluing sand on it. If you were there that day, I apologize. I might have uh, had one too many beer to drink. But it's early today, so uh, I started. Believe it or not, I've taken three screws out and I've needed that many tools. But uh, hang on, because we're about to take a ride. I'm going to turn this into a belt sander. Get some more stuff off of here and uh, get it done. Alright you guys, I got that belt off of there. I did purchase a couple of belts. You know, without getting extravagant. I don't need a uh, horizontal bandsaw. Oh, I don't know. I'd say maybe once a year. Anyways... I got this belt laid up here somewhere around where that pulley is. And then back here I got this other one. My belt wasn't as short. Just quick uh, purchase. So I'm going to have to shorten this a little bit. Got plenty of room to play, right? We'll get that belt to track right. We got plenty of room to uh, adjust our rollers. You know, take a minute. Think about what's coming up next. You're going to have to saw this board off. Move these little feet. You know, if all you got is a handsaw, who cares? It's good enough, right? We'll get this thing done. Let me cut that board off. Move them two feet. Get these belt, these sanding belts on here. And uh, we'll see if we can't actually get this done. Man, if you get a chance and you decide you want to do this, get the exact same belt. The length of belt for your treadmill. Make it match the uh, belt you buy for sanding. I didn't do that. I didn't want to take the time. But anyways, look. This is what I'm going to do. Realizing that this big bolt right here. They welded a nut on here. I don't want to put a whole lot of work into this. And a tiny screw. But, you know, old big girl ain't going to be standing on this anymore. We don't need to have this thing supporting the roller anymore so we're just going to turn this thing around i'm going to uh just move it like this from here to here and i'm going to drill a hole into the bottom of this that will accommodate this screw and then i'll run a tiny little hole up here and we'll get that guy mounted in a matter of minutes let me get that done Man, let me ask you guys a question. I know you, you got this stuff, right? Now, I'm not alone in the world. Right? I'm just digging and digging and digging. I need a couple screws. Right? I know I got them because I took them out of this little coupling right here. Just digging and digging. If I can't find exactly what I need to make it look pretty, will you forgive me? <laughs> hey, I found it. One of them. There's another one in here. I know there is. Oh, there's another one of them couplings. I took it out of a pump. I remember the screws. They're in here somewhere. Come on, man. Where are you at? I need to get a little organized, I think. All right, let me find that thing. I'll be back. I found it. I poked a hole in it right there. We'll bolt it down where it is right now, currently bolted. And then we can get away with the thin walled thread over here with the other one. I missed on this one, but I hogged it out good enough. You know, it's just a belt sander. Let me reassemble this. Okay, you guys, get a load of that. All I've done is flip those two fellas around. Drill two holes. I got them guys on there. There's no back plane on it yet, but, uh, you know, to keep it from moving. But I got them on there. They're tensioned. And let's see if we can track it. You know, uh, come January, you might have to give this back. So, uh, let's see if we can uh, make these belts track. Plug her in and uh, hang on. Right, I got it plugged in. Let's see what's going on here. 
Got to put the safety back in it. Oh, she come to life. This is one of those things you hear if you, uh, you know, mess around. People give you engines and lawn mowers. Well, it ran when I put it away. <laughs> Let's see if this thing works. I'm going to center them back up and uh, we'll start pulling on these adjustments and I'll see if I can't get it running straight. Hang on. I tried for a while to uh, get both of those belts to run on that thing but they must not be the same length I just couldn't do it I guess I could cut that roller down and make it uh, you know six inches wide it'd sure be a whole lot prettier I may go that way I'm not too sure but hey if uh, if you got an old uh, treadmill you need a belt sander once in a while. Buy a belt the same length as the treadmill. Mount that guy on there and uh, make yourself a belt sander. I'm going to cut that board down and mount it in here anyways. And uh, you know, you got to have a wooden backstop on it. I got to sharpen some stuff and lawnmower blades and you know, use this thing for a day and then I could put it all back together just the way I found it. <laughs> the wife will never know <laughs> okay i'm steve thanks for stopping by and giving me somebody to talk to come back because if i like what's going on i'm actually going to mount this thing uh well you know i got a tiny shop there's a lot of stuff in here and uh the last thing i need to do is uh occupy more floor space so uh come on back i think i'm gonna mount it to the wall over here I'll make it go vertical, horizontal, mess around with it. Nothing to lose but uh, a day off on a rainy day. All right, thanks for stopping by. I'm out. <laughs>